this is UK Chaos here, and today this is your typical Fallout 4 video, but with a twist. Uh, well, start off right now. Uh, I have a new software installed, uh, Cam Software NCXT Cam Software, to give me the FPS I wanted. So, if I go up here, if I can tweak the mouse, but I guess not. Okay, uh, Escape. Yeah, Escape works maybe. All right, there we go. Got the mouse off. See up here, guys. Uh, where the mouse is right now. This is something. I wanted to see all my life, or not all my life, but see on Fallout 4 and see what is the problems with all these glitches and everything like that. Then I found, uh, not found, but I stumbled across some very funny information. Um, I don't know if I can believe it or not, but I'm going to believe in it because it makes sense to me. Uh, these weird issues I'm having, FPS and all this sort of stuff, glitches and everything like that. It could be the map or the mod offer uh, not really optimized it. At the same time, it could be get this guys a AMD problem or AMD optimized problem. So I might ha I do I call to people on the internet. I I have one of the best uh, FX series processors for gaming, but it's only Fallout Four. It has its problems. Like my GPU is like not doing that much work it's mainly the cpu and uh, the funny thing is sometimes on like when i'm playing seven ways to die i get solid 60 fps no dips no drops none of that sort of shit on fallout 4 i come on here i look to a certain direction but my fps goes back up to 60. then i look back onto the main area and drop down to 25 to 35. i'm like what the fuck you not know I mean so I have two options right now, is reinstall Fallout 4 and see if that does it and do not build in this location because there's a certain area or a certain point of this map where the, ga the game doesn't like me and I will show you that in a minute. So uh, I did some more building like that without trying to get pissed off too much but I did get pissed off a lot on this and I apologise in advance right now because... I might show that anger back out again because I did this on what day was it on? On Sunday and Monday, I played this for at least I can only play Fallout 4 for hours and hours. But I only got ten minutes in and I got so pissed off because it's like this. Fucking storing so much I'm like, I cannot do this frizzly. If I carry on, I probably will snap a fucking keyboard, guys, so I'm just saying that right now, just be aware because I don't know if the FPS is going to like me more, much longer, but I need to, I probably must I do a free rest, uh, a free, a free, a reinstall of Fallout 4. So, at the same time, I need to get rid of some mods because ugh, certain mods don't work with each other and ugh, problems. So, the FPS is crashing right now, you can clearly state and see. I got two FPS counters, I got one to the left. Is Razor Cortex and one to the right is the NZXT cam software. And I did some more adjustments, not adjustments, more trying to do a bit more salmon building with this awful fucking lag. It probably can't you probably can't notice it, but I can notice it and it's very annoying for me. So I'm gonna keep moving in this direction right now. And let's go into one of the new areas what I've been trying to build for a long very long time. This is like a small little uh, pool area. And if I turn the camera, see the FPS then? Is just tanking itself in this general direction is that glitchy train so at the same time I found some more information about the glitchy train that is a problem with mod offer or AMD so I don't know what to believe or not to believe so looking at that direction my FPS just tanks itself and if I turn back around again back down back up to 60 64 60 I'm like what the fuck so I can't look behind me, and it's kind of hilarious. I fell in the water, so so this is the lovely water right now, where a little, a small, nice little pool is located. And there's the FPS again, um, all this sort of stuff. So I try to build this very calmly. Uh, I put some nice music on, put some bass beat music on in the background, sort of raving, trying to do this. But the FPS was just pissing me straight off, guys, and the FPS just crashes itself again. Uh, down here is the gym area where the uh, where it looks over the swim pool. So I'm going to put a nice little gym down here so you can get nicely and buffed and everything like that. Calm so. myself down doing it, but it didn't work, guys. It did not work at all, so I got really pissed. Uh, this is a new path, I think. Yeah, this is a new path to the hospital. 
Uh, there's a new thing I added, uh, the hospital. Um, I don't know if to show this off guys, but this is the hospital. And it's kind of nice looking really, so two little areas for the hospital so it's not the biggest but it's be there so boom boom and if we go through this door right here this leads to nowhere so like i said i haven't got around to it at all but with the fps all this sort of stuff i'm having i'm not a happy person you can say not a happy camper and uh also my armor looks very funny but don't just don't mind it <laughs> trying the armor out and everything like that so uh don't know what that's not finished but anyway I thought, yeah, see there, it's, it's a lot of problems. Oh, look at the FPS tanks, it fucking hell, boys. So I did a bit of decoration over here, but it did not work at all. And all that sort of stuff. Also, I'm, I show you how I'm technically playing New Vita New Vegas uh, Fallout 4. And I did a bit more decoration, really, so nothing too fancy dancy, really. But I'm, I'm, I'm restarting because I'm not enjoying this game now. It's just too much problems after problems, so I need a new install of uh, Fallout 4 and everything like that. And i show you some things right now, guys, right? And i load save my game right here. Load up the desktop again. Yeah, you made it with an S15, so... I run it through the Nexus launcher. So right here, modern, uh, modern, uh, Fallout 4 script extender, see right there, Fallout SE script extender. I have to run that like that for uh, Place Anywhere. But if I don't run it, and this is the lowest, <laughs> I got, you might laugh at me guys, but it's the funniest sentence I ever have for Fallout 4, when this game loads up. Alright, got options, this is my settings to get it reasonable playable, so, I got everything off, a best play settings, if we go to advanced, that's my settings on medium, but I know my graphics card can push ultra. I, I, I was on high. Turn down to high. Next best one is low, and it's gonna be very funny for that anyway. But let me load Fallout 4 like this without Fallout 4 New Vegas S S New Vegas. Why do we say New Vegas? Well, script extender. So I this is probably the last time you guys see this uh, build because I can doubt I can play on it much longer because it's just getting to a point of me really want to go and swear a bunch. Um, yes, this might be a short video, guys, but I'm trying to stay calm, and I have a tendency of anger problems, so, yeah, <laughs> if if, uh, if I was recording the building process, you'd probably laugh your head off, because I was kind of getting a bit of swearing, a bit of rage going on, I mean, like, trying to place a wall, next bit of wall disappears, and, oh, it's just fucking not nice. It's not the best feeling, man, I mean, that's all i got to say to that. So early in the morning for this also, I just realised that now. <laughs> you probably see what time it is also in this corner, I just realised that. <laughs> At the same time, um, one of the problems i seen, um, oh crap, I can't see the mouse. Uh, to the left hand guy, left hand corner guys, it says RAM usage. Um, I'll keep the keyboard off for a second. See up here guys, uh, it says RAM usage right here. That's a bit scary. I did a bit of testing on that. I put I have a quad channel, not quad channel, dual channel, guys, of two four sticks if to equals eight gig. And I said, wait a minute, why don't I just slap an eight gig stick in from your old computer or the second computer? And it didn't do nothing. So I have no clue what the fuck that RAM use is all about. But anyway, uh, just look at the FPS counter in the, in the corner, guys. I'm gonna walk around the base again uh, to get a last look on it, guys. Of the Soul Side Seven. So I'm on not on the Nexus launcher, and the FPS still tanks itself in this direction. So anywhere I look in the settlement, it's in mainly in that direction. Wait a minute, that's what the train is. It's over. Ooh, okay, scratch that. It's over here somewhere. Then my FPS hates me around this area. Oh wait, the train is over here. Fucking <laughs> dumbass. <laughs> so yeah, train is over here, but the train is right there. What is killing the FPS in this section though? See this. I have no clue what's tanking my FPS, guys. Okay. So, yeah, this is uh, the supermarket area, so... Shame I didn't get around to finish it, but I cannot play on games what it has, like, very low FPS. And it's not nice to play on, like, fucking choppy FPS, so... Oh, look at that. I've seen that before. Also, uh, SOE is kind of a bit buggy. I give it that much right now, guys. Um... I had a, I found a weird bug with it, with the, uh, with the pool water, not the pool water, sorry, the pool walls, 
and somehow I seen through them. Don't know why, that got me pissed off, a bit riled up, so I quit the game. Never went back to it, and this is the first time back now, guys, when I, that was the last draw in this whole type thing, really. Last nail in the coffin, people would say. So, yeah, so, it's a shame, um, yeah, we have to uh, let go of this settlement, because it's gonna go it was going good and everything like that, but I could not play on this any much longer, because... If I play this much longer, guys, I'd probably lose my anger, lose my temper on this, and probably will smash some stuff up. So, I will have to do a fresh reinstall of Fallout 4, and all the mods, probably most likely, it might be the mods. Uh, definitely not going to be... I'd recommend this one, yeah, sure. Recommend this if you have a high-end system. But I thought I have the high-end system. I looked up online about the process. I currently use the AMD FX6300 Black Edition. People say, yeah, it's the best process to use for gaming. I'm like, I do understand that, but Fallout 4 ain't a fucking good processor for it. And if I want to get a good process for this, it's the, uh, fucking, what was it now? The AMD FX 8000, something, 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 Black Edition. Come out, it's got 8 cores, 4 gigahertz, blah, blah, such and such. At the same time, with this processor, guys, I learned something very funny. You can get 5 gigahertz on this. I don't know if it's true or not, but that is fucking nuts. So, I'm not going to overclock my system. My system. Look, look, look at that. Right, there's a clap. There's a prime example right there, guys. This, this map is fucked. You can see through the world. Oh, look at that! Scope through works again. What the fuck? Yeah, also, this scope, no, scope mod. Uh, I have scope through mod. Um, it's kind of like fucking effed sometimes. Sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't work. So, I think this map is just tanking or taking all my FPS and just run away with it. So, I think it's a smart idea to restart again, take out all the FPS uh, enhancements off. And see if that works or not, really. So, I have to make a fresh reinstall because one of the FPS things I installed it goes straight into the Fallout system or directory or whatever you want to call it, and only works like that. So, I need to rip that out and put it back in again. So, probably next week you probably see another Fallout 4 video, brand new, spank brand spanking new Fallout 4 video. And hopefully, the FPS is staying with us. If it ain't, well, I'm not really one happy camper. So, yeah. So, if you like this, guys, smack that like button and hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. And share this with your friends and family. And this has been UK Kill. See you next week, guys. See